There we go. So hello, Lily. How are you? I'm good, thanks. Great. Um, so I'm Lydia. I'm one of the judges on the YMCA's um, Face It competition. We had so many amazing um, entries, but we really liked your one because we really enjoyed your concept. And I loved your pattern as well. It reminded me of um, a pair of shorts I had in the 80s. It was kind of like 80s print. I really loved it. Um, so I shortlisted all the designs um, and I shortlisted yours because, well, one of the aims of the competition was just to try to engage creatively young people into thinking about face coverings, what it means to them, what they think about them. And I thought that yours was especially thought provoking <laughs> because it definitely asked that question, how do people communicate who need to see people's mouths when they talk? So I would love just to hear um, you tell me what inspired you to enter with that design. Um, I was inspired to enter as I think it's a very good competition and I obviously put um, a way to do the mouth as um, you can still see people talking and it helps other people, you know, see what you're talking about. And I did it because it can, I believe that this design can re represent many personalities and I think, yeah. That's brilliant. Yeah, I mean, it was a very interesting idea. And funnily enough, it's not really something that a lot of people are doing. Um, have it, they're called window masks, and there's only a few people that are making those particular coverings. Um, so it was very, it was a great concept. Um, so well done for that. Um, as I said, I made the shortlist, and then we sent those shortlists over to Amber Butchart, who was our star guest judge. She's a presenter and fashion historian. And, um, and she must have liked your design too, because she was the one picking the overall winner. And she picked your design, Lily. You are our winner. <laughs> so congratulations, Lily. You're Thank our you. with five competition winner. Thank you. Oh, you're so welcome. Um, I'd like to read you a quote from Amber, our judge. She said, um, I really like Lily's idea of lip reading. Um, your design was very cheerful and inclusive and so had a really positive message. So, well done. <laughs> You're so welcome. So, um, so what's happening now is your design has gone over to our local textile designer, Patrick Moriarty, um, and he's been uploading your designs to print some fabric with your, with your pattern on it. So that's already underway, that's already happening. Um, we um, took the liberty of just changing your idea ever so slightly where you said there's a mesh here. We've actually just put um, a plastic kind of uh, see-through vinyl window, window there instead of a mesh just for, you know, just so that it's kind of yeah. completely covered. Um, so that's all we've done. Um, and then I'll have to get a couple of little measurements from you, which we can do afterwards, just so we can make sure it fits really well. And, and that's it really. So I've just got one more question for you which is do you like to shop <laughs> you've got yes. a one, <laughs> you've got a 100 pound uh, love to shop voucher coming over to you and um, you can spend it Thank in, you. you can have a look you're so welcome and um, do you have any other questions no not really i think it's a really good competition good Thank you. <laughs> well, we really enjoyed looking at everyone's entries. There were some, some amazing, amazing ones on there, but your one stood out for your idea and your inclusivity. So really well done, Lily. That's great. And uh, you're welcome. Uh, that's all really. That's, that's all we wanted to say. Congratulations. You're our winner. <laughs> amazing. Um, so what we'll do is we will um, get in touch with you after the um, call and um, take your measurements and um, get your address so that we can send out your voucher and you can uh, go and spend it. So happy spending, happy shopping. Thanks. <laughs> okay. Thank you so much for taking the time to do this. It was nice talking to you. And you too. All right, I'll speak to you soon. Bye. Bye. <laughs>